Friday morning and we're off. Pacey's flying that flag. I don't remember what kind of hell it is, but I know it's old. So I went over to Cajun and purchased a couple parts. I got new skid pipes because apparently that one just decided to break off. And then I got hard dampers again. And I'm gonna replace those dampers and replace that skid pipe. And then I'm gonna try and fix the wobble because those soft ones made it worse. So I'm going back. So we'll uh, give it a shot here. Waking up a little bit. And uh, we'll see what happens. Got some over at the BK Hobby Sense. Come and ask questions. This is not. Oh, there we go. Place that better to Jonas, huh? Oh, yes. So, Jonas is the designer of this helicopter. He came all the way from Germany. First time at Urza. Yeah. We're a little late to the party, but it's never too late. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Good job. We're having an amazing time here. We're flying our. Sunsky 3530 motor with the Sunsky Grand Avenue C and I'll um, be probably 5,100 million hour turbine batteries. Flying all the type of ultimate 700 and 106. Um, and that's a flow controller from Raymond Master with a CX69S. And I think you can tell that this model is an amazing performer. Also, if you make some noise, Jan will fly lower, I'm sure. And Radio Master told me that they're going to give away a Quadro system uh, during the uh, demos today at noon. So all you have to do is go to the Radio Master tent, register to win it, and then come here on the news. And uh, you have a chance to win a Radio Master Quadro system. Lower! You did a good job with this, Jonas. It's a nice machine. There you go. Come on, give it up for him, everybody! So with this kit, you get two booms. You get a power run and a plugger run. Yeah, you get two booms, one in cover fiber for highest performance you can get. And the plug run that Jan is flying right now, so it's going to be really capable, as you can see. And also, very visible, right? Very visible, yes. Yeah. You also get a couple other goodies, like two battery phase, different layer of geometry, palm dampers, and rubber damper. You get several horns with it. You get several horns with plastic and aluminum. Dan, how about a quick Magumu for us? Make that whole stream. So check it out, rfbhobby.com. Buy the RC, it's the local US distributor or your favorite retailer. But we're about to do that A on the sign over there. Oh, oh very important here. Oh, oh, nice one. Yeah, and uh, yeah, the incentive is available here at Buddy RC. They have fixed with them. But you can get it almost everywhere now. First, you carry them. The main part is found. Yeah, we can have it. Yeah. Um, I'm sure I'm forgetting a couple of retailers, but uh, they're everywhere now. So just go find your favorite retailer and give yourself an unsettled. No one. Oh, that was, <laughs> I was very unexpected. I like that one. That was cool. Come on, make some noise. Come on, people, make some noise. Very nice. Well done. Nice. Thank you guys. Thank you, Andy. Thank you, Jonas. Amazing one. All right, Patrick's gonna not crash his M4s right now, right? It'll be a boring flight in that case. Hmm. It's kind of a hard decision. Boring or crash or not crash. <laughs> I don't know if it'll work. It worked yesterday. Well, I crashed it since then. Uh, <laughs> what?
works. And it's flat. Nice. It's sort of mostly. <laughs> yeah. Good enough. <laughs> that was more fish than I was expecting. Oh god. Oh god. He's got a resonance, sir. There you go. It's gone. Yay! A landing! One piece! <laughs> One pieces! <laughs> I landed it! <laughs> How's the tuning with the uh, Nexus? Well, ever since I discovered yesterday there's a phone app and I can plug my phone right in. I'm loving it. Yes? I can clap on these uh, USB adapter cables into my Samsung and we're rocking and rolling. Thank you all, Lorraine Brothers. Nice. <laughs> you can see the tremendous control of the Nexus with its very advanced control algorithms. It's not just a simple PID loop, it has quite a bit more going on in the back. So you can, for example, go fast and give big control inputs without it freaking out. Or you can go low and slow with tremendous control like Jan is showing here. Tremendous. Oh yes, McDougal. big McDougal, big over speed. Nice one. got the hard dampers back in and it's a little bit better still wobbly but at least it's viable the other thing I did was reduce my cyclic travel in the icon because I think it was so much that no matter how low the gain was it just couldn't handle it and it is better now so I'm gonna fly it real quick here
That was loud.
Oh. <laughs> it's more broken this time. This one Patrick, no, you can't just replace your servo arms this time. <laughs> <laughs> that over we just did. <laughs> you don't need positive collective, just let it hit the ground, I think. Don't worry, that canopy is broken survive? like that. Look out, dude, how did your skid survive? <laughs> It's so impressive, yeah. This is yeah. Good. Good. yeah. It's it's we have parts. Push rod seems good. Oh, bang on. We have parts. You can just we bend do. that boom back. I already did. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is already an unbent boom. <laughs> awesome. Cool. My, my fingers are cold, man. I bet. Fine. Oh, shit. I think I've your pitch arm's a little fucked up there. We have another. Holy shit. Oh, my <laughs> God. Oh, man. What? Dude, my servo arms are fine! How do you know? Actually. That fucked up. Are they all moving? <laughs> They're fine! <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Keith, did you see what it took to, to mess my servo arms up and that didn't do it? That's cool. Interesting. That was fantastic. Well, anyway, that was a solid one. It tumbled. It, that was a crash. It that was up. a proper crash. It balled up. I love those. Is that it? Come on! <laughs> Why are you so high in the air? Come on! <laughs> <laughs> That's that a different my, way of doing that. I've never <laughs> seen that done that way. I like it. That was it was good. I like that. <laughs> what hell is that? Nimbus Petrol. It's his third one of the weekends. <laughs> if that says anything. <laughs> But yeah, he flying two of them. <laughs> the two that went in when he wasn't even flying. It's on his third one of the weekend. Usually he gets to wreck all these helicopters. This weekend it's other people for him. <laughs> he hands the transmitter. What a brand new helicopter. <laughs> 